Coming up this week on The Choice. Muzzle loader, shotgun, rifle, crossbow, archer. It's our choice. Welcome to the choice. This week. This we're week we're having, heading down to South Texas. Right. On the Covenant Ranch. Yes, and we're going to go bow hunting whitetail deer. And yes. rifle hunting bobcats on predator calling. Yes, but in the meantime, we're actually learning to play a little bit more with and guns. You know, <laughs> you know, we've always said that the choice is all about us learning on how to do all this. and. and I'm not used to earplugs, you know so I, I don't know if I'm talking too loud or... But you know what I found out that I really like about these earplugs what? is that when I have them in both my ears... Yeah, they help, don't they? Well, I can't hear you anymore and it really makes me happy. Let's try shooting some more skeet. Okay, ready? Pull! No, oh, darn it. Who hit it? I'll give you that one. Well, we're back down the Covenant Ranch. We haven't been down here in about four years now. I've got my black polar fleece, which is all full of little lint fuzzy things, but that's not going to matter. We're going to be out in the macho blinds, and hopefully they've been seeing some really good deer out there, and we're going to go and give it a try. Got all my gear here, waiting for, for Jody and Hal to get their booties going. Burr. What are you doing? I just heard the dog go, Burr. Calling his hound dog, Vic, what is it with this barking stuff? Ro, ro, ro. Whoa, little. Let's not go there. You look good. Jody, picking this up at all? Yeah, that's kind of the question, guys. I ain't never seen so many Jody. people with radios, Jody. but nobody uses them. Oh. oh yeah, baby! Did you see that? Hey. I hit her chunk. My chunk? Yeah, it was a chunk. Is that, is that the, the it correct was a termination it was a, of it? A I chunk? I'm not sure. I really don't know what no, we're doing. No, let's just get into Ralph's hunt. Yeah, my hunt school. Oh, easy. We just got in blind. It's my turn to hunt. Yeah, baby. And uh, they, what they do here down on the government out these little video cameras and they could tell where their management bucks are, where they need to take them. This morning they found that they had a nice buck coming in, an older, looks like a 10 point. The rat comes up and curves. 
neighbors around, um, and they definitely want him out of the herd. So they called the management busters, Vicky and I, and here we are, we'll see what happens. Now here's the situation. We're sitting there, Ralph's got his window wide open ready for the shooting. I look out the one little peephole on the side here, on the right side, and I see a buck right there. Ralph has no shot opportunity. He closes up his window very quietly, opens up another shooting window on the side so he can take his buck. Talk about luck. Bunker blind. I love this thing. Cute. Really cute. Hey! You guys are on my arrow. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> it's right on the crease. Awesome. Awesome. There's a dead deer laying around. Spitfire. There he is. There he is right there. <laughs> so he didn't go far. Oh, how are we going to get him out of there? He ran over here and stopped. Yeah, look at right through this. You hold this, we'll drag him out. No, I'll get him. <laughs> what? Huh? You're not one he of them hunters that likes. No, he likes thorns and hurt himself, so let him do it. Let him. Ralph, those are thorns. I don't care. That's my deer. <laughs> yes. Oh, pull, him, pull, him, pull him out head first. He'll fly to you. <laughs> awesome. Look at that beautiful. <clears throat> Man, look at the pile of blood there. That's a spitfire, baby. How are those thorns? Thorns are pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're... They're definitely South Texas thorns. Give me one antler. We're back here down in the Covenant, hunting out of the macho blinds, and what can you tell? I mean, another magnificent South Texas deer. Just so you know, back home it's minus 10 degrees, and I think it's going to be about 50 today. And people say, why do you go hunt Texas? Hmm. Do I have to tell you why? <laughs> wow. Pull. Oh. Now let's get to my hunt. <laughs> oh, Jody just dropped us off just now. We got in the blind. It's about, oh heck, it's four o'clock. We got out of here a little bit later. 
But that's because generally Francisco wouldn't be quiet and he wouldn't let Ralph leave the- Folks, notice how the camera's pointing up. <laughs> it's four o'clock. This morning, Ralph shot a beautiful nine point around the same blind that we're sitting in right now. We know that they've been seeing a lot more deep, a lot more fox and deer around here. We tried to get out of here as quietly as we could this morning, took some photos and left. We'll just sit tight and see what happens, see if we can get something coming through. Stay tuned, the choice will return. Welcome back to the choice. Well, it's your turn, Vic, finally to put it, I gotta tell you, you're shooting pretty darn good. You know, I gotta tell you, you're shooting a 12 gauge and I'm shooting a 20, and I'm hitting as many as mine with my 20 as you're doing with your 12. I think there's twice as many BBs in the 12 gauge as there is for a 20, so I think I'm doing really good. You're nuts. Let's get into my hunt. Yeah, you better, because that's a bunch of bull. I gotta ask the guys that. Is it true? <laughs> I don't know. It's just beautiful. We watched him do a rub, make like a little scrape, do a little shaking of the silly ears. I think his one ear is kind of droopy. He is just 
a beautiful, beautiful, I'm not touching you, beautiful South Texas whitetail. Look at that. Okay, so you think you're pretty hot. You think you're pretty good with that gun. Why don't we get into your bobcat hunt? That was oh, kind of fun. It is fun. You know, getting into this gun hunting stuff is really awesome because you could reach out and touch something now. You don't have to wait <laughs> till it gets, you know, like real bow range. I'm, I'm digging this. And I, did I did I make that a perfect shot? Well, we're here with Javi. Hal just dropped off the, the, the buggy, whatever we want to call it, huh? And that's Javi's face mask, <laughs> so you know. Don't worry, we're gonna get some HS face masks for these guys down here. But uh, we're, we're actually setting up. It's an overcast day. It should be still good. New day calling. We're, we're down here on the Covenant, South Texas, and we're with some of the best guides we could have for hunting predators. Welcome back to The Choice. Now let's get back to my predator calling on the bobcats. shoot um, guns pretty well here. Obviously, let's get into my bobcat footage, speaking of shooting guns very well. I didn't put it up on my shoulder good. Oh. <laughs> let's get into the footage. <laughs> How's that feel? We're set up in one of the rifle stands. We've got a caller out there. Our guy calls the bobcats into us or coyotes. That's kind of weird. I've ever set up in a gun stand with a gun. Strike one. Strike two, Vic. Where are you going, girl? Yeah, baby. Now, that there's some shooting. <laughs> yep. We hope you enjoyed this week on The Choice. And I mean, it just, thanks to everybody down on the Covenant for making that happen. And you know, a lot of times you guys may think, oh, South Texas, South Texas. And I think we proved it why we go down there. One, you have the opportunity to see a whole bunch of deer. Yeah. You might have gone the whole season and, and got one opportunity at a buck. You go to Texas and you could have 20 opportunities. I dig that, and the temperature. And then to close the show, to close the show, we want to share a special, a special portion of footage for you with Joey. Yep. We want to thank Hale and Covenant Ranch for making his dream come true. Joey wanted to shoot a buck really bad, and they put it together for him, and he's quite the guy. I mean, you talk about, if this doesn't touch your soul, folks, I don't know what's going to. I mean, you know, yeah. here it is, a dream come true, and it's just like all of us out there, all of us, and that is, dreams do come true. And if we all work together, They'll be there for all of us. 
So we want to thank you for making your choice. The choice. We'll see you next week. Congratulations. Congratulations, buddy. That is Dang. awesome. Thanks to you guys too. Yeah, oh, man. Oh, man. Absolutely beautiful. Mm. We heard that you got it, and we were like, come on, let's go to the lodge. That's what we're asking. Where are you going with it? We want to see it. Oh, wow. Man. All right. That, they were, uh, that is awesome, buddy. I'm so is. proud of you. Oh, thanks for bringing out that crossbow. Oh, hey, it helped hey. out a lot. Well, yeah. Where was that? Man, that's okay. your help to turn. Oh, it did. Well, uh, I've got a couple of things. Thanks, I mean, it was a whole team effort, man. Yeah. Everyone did so much. That was awesome.